Let's buy something dumb from AliExpress and see if we get what we paid for in today's episode. Woo! Out of space review. Welcome Space Cadet to another episode of Outer Space Reviews. In today's episode, we're buying from AliExpress. Expectation versus reality. Over the past few years, since about uh, 2001, Bandai of China have been releasing some almost one-to-one -one scale toys in a way to test the Japanese market. As you've seen before, the link is up here. We did the Seiken Sword Driver set. We've also reviewed the Ankokuken Kuriyami. Link is also up here. But they've also released things such as Falcon Sword, the Mumei Ken Kyomu. They also released recently a large scale Magnum Shooter 40X. And in the future, they're also going to release a large scale Geek Buster QB9. But importantly, in today's episode, what we are going to purchase from AliExpress is the large-scale gun sword Jikan Grade from Kamen Rider Geo. As you all know, I love collecting ride watches. The link is up here for our most recent episode on ride watches. We're going to do a follow-up soon, I promise. Fact, they announced a large-scale version of the Jikan Grade. Oh my god. Oh my god. I need this item, like, holy dooly. So I am going on to AliExpress today and... I'm going to look for it myself and we're going to purchase it. But then I'm going to fast forward the clock so you don't have to wait. Otherwise, it's going to be a two, uh, a two week episode of me just sitting around doing nothing. And when we get the item delivered, I'm going to open it up and see what we got. Hopefully, if it's the actual item, I will do a review on it. Otherwise, you only have this episode and I'm going to have to try to do it again. And then I'm going to have to fight to get a refund on that item. Just pray through this episode and be like, oh, or be a negative Nelly and be like, haha, I hope they don't get it. So let's get started. <laughs> As you can see, I've got AliExpress set up right here. I've already typed in the keywords, which is Kamen Rider and Sword. So let's quickly see what items we have on this storefront on the first page. So we've got some figure arts. So that's Sus Sword. We got Blade. We got Deno Sword Form. Like, you're not wrong, but it's not what we want. We got characters from Saber. We have a Holy Sword getting there. We got the Jikan Grade, but that's for a figure. And it's $37. Oh, that's pricey. All right, so this is a prop item. Thousand Jacker Sword for um, Kamen Rider Thousa. It's not what we're after. Kamen Rider Black Shirt. Oh, in pink. Hello. Kamen Rider Psycho. We have the Kamen Rider Saber Second Sword Driver set. Looking, oh, oh, I think we got something. Rider Kick figures, questionable Saber figurines. And here we go, we got the first item here, Jikan Grade Sword. Some builds there, I'm gonna open up some right now. So we got one for 182, 194, 207. Oh, look at that. Ooh, is this the, no, this is the original one. I thought this was a pre-order for the QB9. I think we got a good price here, so I'm going to open up those. Alright, I think we got a few. So we got four tabs open. Kamen Rider Series Spherical Toy. It says it's 400 millimeters, 40 centimeters, goes into 84 centimeters. This might be it, but it is going for $194. It's kind of pricey. It's got free returns, but just have to keep looking. I know we can do cheaper. 182, we're getting there, we're getting there. The color is Zio, sweet. This is what it's like inside the box. That's what it's like when you take it out. So this is what we're hoping to get. So we'll keep moving. I'm gonna leave this one open. I'm gonna go to the next one, 207. Sorry, mate, too much. So here we go. This might be the one we're gonna purchase. So it's $158, 21 cents. So it's $158 and 21 cents. It's 19% off, weird numbers, I know. So we're hoping for this item to arrive in early May. No picks of the item itself, but this is the box. This is what we know what it looks like as per other reviewers on YouTube. Item is described communication 4.6 is not bad. It's actually pretty good, but they're also selling the uh, China re-release of the uh, Kamen Rider Fires driver. So that's very tempting in itself, but it's a hundred dollars. I know I could get the original release. It's got a lot of five stars recently. This store does seem to have a uh, really good uh, feedback. Hmm, I'm hoping that they send us the big toy and not this. If I get this, oh my god, I'm gonna buy it now. Cool, so 
We've now purchased the item. Move the clock forward and see what we got. All right, guys, it's been 17 days since we ordered that item. And in those 17 days, I got sick. Sick of waiting. <coughs> <laughs> but I am keen to open up whatever parcel we received from AliExpress. One thing I should mention though is be careful with the tax because they charged us a day later with the tax. So you know it was about 158 Australian that we originally thought was the price but then they decided to hit us with tax. I was like can't you do it all at once? That'd be a little bit nicer wouldn't it? Mm. Good. All right so it's a big one but I think I need some scissors. Wait, 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 wait. All right, so we managed to get some scissors. Let's find out if it's not a big box of nothing. So we are expecting something big, because if it's a gun, it's gonna be about, yeah, and I'm gonna be like, mm, baby. But yeah, I'm worried it's gonna be like some two items. So one here and one here. And then when I open it up, it's gonna be like, but everything falls out in the back. Oh well, 170 so dollars, let's go. Oh, I damaged it. <gasps> It's a bit damaged, not from me. <laughs> it's because they're not good when it comes to uh, packaging items that are going overseas. Over the past 17 days, um, I saw a lot of horror stories about AliExpress and Taobao and how they just go <laughs> <laughs> And then you just gotta pray to your various uh, deities and hope for the best that it's not completely damaged. Are you ready? Ooh, and it comes with corners. Ooh, corner guards. Oh my God. We got it in a somewhat doable box condition. Yay! I'll show you the back. <laughs> look, look at that damage. <laughs> like the front. Oh my God, it's so great. But the back. Come in. <laughs> ah, but yes, here we go. From Kamen Rider Zio, the gun sword, Jakan Great. I'm gonna try that again. From Bandai China, the big scale gun sword, Jikan grade from Kamen Rider Zio. This is the one thing you gotta worry about when you purchase from uh, Taobao, AliExpress, and it's a big box, the damage. Damage to the item will be a bit ugh. So if you're looking for like mint, 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 mint condition of the box, you won't get it, unfortunately. I'm glad it's not broken in half. I hope, but yeah, the box condition is okay for what we're getting. There's no other way to get this item without it being shipped directly from China. So let's quickly inspect the item. We're not going to do a review. That will be in another episode, but we're going to quickly inspect to see if the item inside is not broken. It's a pizza, pizza, pizza. Ready? The box is so damaged. I can't even pull it out the normal way I do. Oh, cardboard. Ah. <gasps> Look at that! It's a gun! It's a sword! It's a gun sword! So we managed to properly acquire the Kamen Rider Zio Jikan Grade. I'm very happy about that. I'm gonna quickly... Oh, we got the ride watch adapter piece. Oh, we got the gun and there goes the sword. <laughs> Lol jokes, they don't break it. I do. So look at that! <sighs> It feels great to actually have a big weapon instead of just like the piddly stuff. Beep, beep. Look at the difference. It's crazy. Like, I don't have the DX Chikan grade because it's just too tiny. But oh, I am I am enthralled by how great this is. So we'll quickly ch change it to sword. There we go. That's how big it is. Nah, kid. I'll show you, we'll quickly change it. And there we go. <laughs> uh, it's definitely not as big as the prop, but to finally have a big weapon from Kamen Rider Zio is crazy. Yes, you can put it back like that, but then you got to really <laughs> hold it out. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but I'm so happy to get what I wanted from AliExpress instead of getting something that was damaged or the wrong item or a whole bunch of junk. Sometimes there's, you get junk sent to you, but wow, really happy with this purchase. So happy with it. But now in the comments, what items would you like to see uh, Bandai make from Kamen Rider Zio or from Super Sentai 
or Ultraman or any other series, would you consider purchasing this weapon? I think it is great. Maybe they'll bring out a Gates one. So look forward in the future for a new episode where we actually review this item. But otherwise, Space Cadet, thank you so much for watching today's episode. Remember to like and subscribe. Definitely subscribe if you haven't already so you can see the review for this bad boy. I think we're one of the first people in the West to actually have this item and then review it. Liking also lets us know that you would love to see more of our content, especially when it comes to big toy reviews. It just oh, it makes me happy just looking at this thing. It is great. It is great. But other than that, we hope to catch you in the next episode where we will review this. I don't know. But until then, you have a good one, and we'll see you later. Bye! <laughs>